Hey friend, welcome to my channel, Crane Elude, where we deep dive and break down the most iconic stars in history. If you're not yet subscribed, please be sure to do so and turn on your notification bells so you never miss an upload. Now let's get into this video. Today we are doing a breakdown for Adriana Lima. Adriana Lima is one of the most well-known supermodels in the industry and the reason behind her fame is quite apparent. She is nothing short of a true icon. Lima has conquered the modeling industry with her striking beauty that has captivated audiences internationally. She was born in Brazil in 1981 and was signed to Elite Model Management at the age of 16, which jump-started her career. Not only is she a model, but a former Victoria's Secret angel, and as such, she has received quite a few awards for her contributions to the fashion industry in 2014. She was awarded the Fashion Icon Award at the first annual AM FAR Inspiration Gala, while in 2017, she received recognition for her humanitarian aid work at Harper's Bazaar Woman of the Year Award. Lima's influence is felt globally and she has been a crucial figure in shifting the modeling industry's standard of beauty. Young girls worldwide look up to her and aspire to be like her. She has been recognized for her influence, making Forbes' highest paid models list several times, ranking in fifth place in 2013 and sixth place in 2014. Lima has graced the covers of numerous magazines worldwide, including Vogue, Marie Claire, GQ, and Harper's Bazaar. She she has also walked in over 650 fashion shows, making her one of the most experienced and talented runway models. Lima's legacy is one that will be remembered in the fashion industry for many years to come. She has been praised for her modeling talent and the impact she has had on the industry, inspiring many young girls worldwide to follow in her footsteps. Her impact has been felt by colleagues and fans alike, as evidenced in her noteworthy tribute by fellow supermodel Naomi Campbell, who spoke highly of her influence. But do you know that there was a time when she first came into the industry, people were obsessed with her virginity? It was a pretty weird time for her and she has been known to call out men who bring it up in conversations or interviews. GQ once named you the world's most voluptuous virgin. Thank you. You were 27 and still a virgin. Oh my God, we're going there? We don't have to. <laughs> we, don't have, we don't have to. Well, I mean, I, I, does it make you uncomfortable? Do you talk like that with girls like that? Do like what? Go, like you are a... Uh, Sometimes. The word. <laughs> so Adriana Lima, the Brazilian supermodel, has been making headlines for her choice to remain a virgin until marriage. While this may seem like a personal preference, the media couldn't help but make a big deal out of it. Some may argue that this is because Adriana is known for her sultry, sexy image. Can a woman not embrace her sensuality without being assumed to be promiscuous? That's a question for you guys to dabble in in the comment section. Adriana's stance on virginity highlights a bigger issue in the modeling industry that objectification of women. The industry often puts pressure on models to be sensually available and virginity is rarely seen as a desirable trait. But why should a woman's worth be determined by her experience? Despite this pressure, Adriana stood firm in her beliefs. In an interview with GQ, she explained, sex is for after marriage. Men have to respect that this is my choice, end quote. It's clear that Adriana values herself and body and expects men to do the same. This should not be seen as an unusual controversial topic but rather a basic expectation that should be extended to all women. But unfortunately, the media still couldn't resist making a fuss over her virtue. However, she handled it with grace and humor, joking in an interview with Andy Cohen saying, why is everybody asking me about my V-card? It's private, end quote. In the end, Adriana's decision to remain virtuous until marriage is her own and her worth as a woman and a model should not be defined by it. She had a couple other controversies surrounding that before we get into her beauty, personality, and childhood. But what is this controversy you speak of? This controversy is her faith, her religious beliefs. When it comes to Adriana Lima, most people immediately envision her strutting down the runway in nothing more than a lingerie and wings. What many don't know is that behind her image lies a deeply religious woman who is devoted to her Catholic faith and spirituality. In a 2006 interview with GQ, Lima revealed that she is a devout Roman Catholic who attends mass every Sunday. She even denounced termination of pregnancies as a crime and states that she agrees with all the church's teaching. This may come as a surprise to those who assume that Victoria's secret angels are all about breaking the rules and living on the wild side. What's even more surprising is that Lima would bring a copy of the Bible with her backstage before she goes on stage. While most models are busy preparing 
wearing their makeup and outfits, Lima takes a moment to connect with her faith and seek protection from the angels. This showed how crucial her spirituality is to her, even in the highly centralized world of fashion. She has also made mentions of communicating with nature, energy, and spirits. She pays tribute to Manja, a water spirit from the Yarba religion on her social media. Lima regularly pays tribute to her on her social media accounts and she's even been spotted wearing necklaces and bracelets featuring the spirit's likeness. This shows that Lima has a broader view of spirituality and of course Lima's faith has not come without criticism. Some have questioned how she can reconcile her religious views with her job as a lingerie model. They argue that it goes against the teachings of the Catholic Church which encourages women to dress modestly and cover their bodies. But Lima has defended herself stating that wearing lingerie on the runway is just a job and that she doesn't see it as conflicting with her faith. She believes that as long as she has pure intentions and connects with the divine, she is protected by the angels. And according to Lima, she said, the church is in me. I am always connected. If you're connected with the divine and always have pure intentions with everything you're doing, you're protected by the angels, end quote. But what about that infamous Bible she's been spotted carrying around at fashion shows? Well, according to Lima, it serves as a reminder of her faith and helps her to stay grounded amidst the madness of the industry. She's a firm believer in staying connected to the divine and always having pure intentions and she believes that this protects her and surrounds her with angels comment below your thoughts what do you guys feel about that do you think that her wearing lingerie and being a catholic go hand in hand or do you think hey hmm, i don't know in the end lima's religious views may appear contrasting with her job but it shows that a person can have a multifaceted identity and after all as she herself once said i'm very spiritual i believe in nature i believe in energy i believe in spirits she's not just a pretty face or a body to be admired but someone with depth values and beliefs and even if it may seem unconventional her devotion to her faith only highlights her unique beauty and spirit now speaking of beauty many of you guys may want to know her beauty secrets because look at her she's gorgeous adriana lima is a well-known victoria's secret angel who has managed to maintain her youth beauty over the years the stunning brazilian model has captured the hearts of many and it's not hard to see why first it's essential to note that adriana takes her skincare very seriously she maintains a streak regimen that includes cleansing toning and moisturizing daily she is also known to use natural face masks made from ingredients such as honey and avocado avocado which nourishes and hydrates the skin. Furthermore, Adriana has never been one to shy away from talking about the importance of drinking water. According to her, water is the ultimate beauty secret. She believes that hydration is key to maintaining healthy and youthful looking skin. Another factor that contributes to Adriana's flawless skin is her diet. Being a model, it's no surprise that Adriana has a healthy and balanced diet. She regularly incorporates fruits, vegetables, and lean proteins into her meals. Some of her favorite foods include grilled fish and vegetables, quinoa, and fresh fruits. Although Adriana is not known to have had any plastic surgery, she has admitted to having some minor procedures done such as laser treatments to remove sunspots and freckles. Aside from her fitness routine, which includes boxing, running, and yoga, Adriana has a passion for dancing. She believes that it's not only a great way to stay in shape but also a way to relieve stress and have fun. Adriana's favorite color is reportedly blue. Speaking of her wardrobe, the supermodel has a great sense of style and can rock anything from stylish casual wear to glamorous red carpet outfits. When it comes to her hair, Adriana loves to experiment with different styles but has a signature long wavy look that she's famous for. She often styles her hair in loose waves or sleek straight locks. Now, what is her personality like for those who are interested? According to those who know her best, Adriana is an absolutely wonderful person to be around. She's kind, generous, and always up for a good time. Her friends have described her as down to earth and fun loving with a wicked sense of humor that keeps everyone laughing. Though her fellow models have reported that she's fiercely competitive and will stop at nothing to win. That's what has made her so successful though. And it's clear that her drive and determination has served her well. Her bosses too have nothing but great things to say about her. Lima is known for her professionalism and dedication to her work. She takes every job seriously and works tirelessly to ensure that everything is perfect. She is often praised for her incredible work ethic and ability to keep 
calm under pressure. Despite her beauty and success, it's clear that Adriana is not a diva. She's humble and approachable, always willing to lend a helping hand or offer a kind word for those around her. When she's not working, she loves to spend time with her family and friends and enjoy cooking and listening to music. She's also an avid traveler and has listed Bali as one of her all-time favorite destinations. Despite her stunning looks and glamorous lifestyle, Adriana is actually quite the homebody. She loves nothing more than curling up on a couch with a good book and is often found relaxing in her pajamas when she's not out and about. She's also incredibly dedicated to her charity work and has been known to spend hours working with underprivileged children in her free time. Now let's get into her childhood. Adriana Lima's childhood was far from ordinary. The Brazilian supermodel was born on June 12, 1981 in Salvador, Brazil to a carpenter and social worker. Sadly, her father left the family when she was just six years old, leaving Lima to be raised solely by her mother, Maria Lima. Lima's multi-ethnic background adds to her unique beauty. She comes from a diverse mix of Portuguese, native Brazilian, African, Japanese, Swiss, and West Indian descent, but she personally identifies as Afro-Brazilian. It's a little known fact that Lima is multilingual and speaks four languages, Portuguese, English, Italian, and Spanish. Despite coming from humble beginnings, Lima was determined to achieve great things in life. From a young age, she dreamt of becoming a pediatrician and helping sick children. I was a very shy kid. I always wanted to do everything that the boys was doing, playing football, climbing on trees, playing with cars, because I was like literally all day into the books, studying, 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 studying non-stop, like crazy. I thought I was going to be a pediatrician, and that's what I wanted, I wanted to be a doctor. Modeling came to me by surprise, and everything happened so fast. However, fate had different plans for her and she soon found herself being scouted by modeling agencies in her hometown. Despite being hesitant at first, Lima eventually decided to pursue a career in modeling, which would soon catapult her to fame and fortune. However, she has never forgotten her roots and often speaks about her upbringing in interviews. Lima has stated that growing up, she and her mother lived in a small apartment in Salvador and money was often tight. However, her mother worked hard to provide for her and Lima learned the value of hard work and perseverance from an early age. She was once quoted saying, I've been poor my whole life and sometimes when you grow up with that, it sticks with you. However, she also said that growing up poor taught her to be independent and never take things for granted. Despite growing up in poverty, Lima's childhood was not without its joys. She had spoken about how she loved to play soccer and climb trees with her friends and how her mother always encourages her to follow her dreams. Lima attended several schools throughout her childhood, including a Catholic school where she learned English and Italian. She has even stated that as a child, she once wore her school uniform to a modeling job because she didn't own any other clothes. One little known secret about Lima's childhood is that she often skipped school to attend modeling auditions, much to her mother's dismay. However, her mother eventually became supportive of her career aspirations, and the rest, as they say, was history. Although Lima's childhood was marred by her father's absence, she has spoken about how her mother was a strong and inspirational figure in her life. She has stated that her mother taught her to always believe in herself and never give up on her dreams. Adriana was discovered at the age of 13 when she participated in a Ford Super supermodel of Brazil contest. While she didn't win, it was a stepping stone to her modeling career. Shortly after, at the age of 15, she won the Ford Supermodel of the World contest and moved to New York City to pursue her dreams. The first agency to sign her was Elite Model Management. Adriana went on to work with several high fashion designers such as Giorgio Armani, Valentino, and Versace. She also became a Victoria's Secret Angel in 1999 and walked in their annual fashion show for almost 20 years. Adriana has also made appearances in several films like The Follow and The Ocean's 8. She even played herself in the hit TV show Ugly Betty but it's her commercial work that really made her a household name. She has been the face of Maybelline and has worked with a variety of other brands, including Kia Motors. Now let's talk about her stint in Victoria's Secret real quick. It was the greatest time of my life and that's gonna stay with me forever. So when you say Victoria's Secret, what do you think? <laughs> the mere mention of it is enough to send you down a rabbit hole of silky lingerie and angelic wings, right? And when it comes to talking about Victoria's Secret, there is one name that comes to mind, and that's Adriana Lima, the quintessential Victoria's Secret angel. Adriana Lima's beauty could be nothing less than celestial, and her smile 
alone could light up the runway. But besides all that dazzle, there was some behind the scenes secrets about her journey that you need to know. But first, let's start with how it all began for her. Adriana Lima got her start with Victoria's Secret in 1999 at the young age of 18 after a friend introduced her to an agency in Brazil. She made her debut on the runway show in 1999 and quickly became a fan favorite. Soon after, she signed a lucrative contract with the brand and the rest, as they say, is history. It wasn't all smooth sailing for Lima. She ran into her fair share of difficulties in her early days as a Victoria's Secret angel. She was told that her accent was too thick and she needed to learn English to improve communication with the brand's representatives. And that's exactly what she did. She learned the language from scratch dedicating herself to become fluent in English. Lima also had to face body shaming in the industry, just like most models do. She was under constant scrutiny to maintain her slim figure, which led her to adopt strict diets and workout regimens to appear picture perfect on the runway. However, Lima's strong will and dedication shone through as she ensured that she didn't compromise on her health while maintaining her perfect figure. And let's not forget the beauty treatments that are part of the job. Can you imagine how much effort it takes to maintain your angel status, Lima went through extensive beauty treatments and lead up to each Victoria's Secret show, including intensive workouts with personal trainers, spa sessions to relax her muscles, and skincare routines to make her skin glow. But despite all these challenges, Adriana Lima was the epitome of grace, beauty, and elegance on a Victoria's Secret one rate. She was a fan favorite for years, and her swan song came in 2018, where she retired with her wings held high, leaving a remarkable legacy in the industry. And she has been known to really speak out too badly against Victoria's Secret as some former models do. She still shows a lot of gratitude and respect for them. Now as far as her relationships go, Lima's first big relationship was with the American singer Lanny Kravitz. They fell in love in 2001 and moved in together shortly after. The couple even got engaged and Lima was featured in Kravitz's music video for Yesterday Is Gone. However, their love story came to an abrupt end when they decided to break up in 2003. The reason behind their breakup remains a mystery to this day. Some sources claim it was due to their hectic schedules and being away from each other. However, others speculate that Kravitz's wandering eyes might have led to their split. Whatever the reason, fans were broken to see the couple's fairy tale love story come to an end. Lima moved on and found love again in the arms of Serbian NBA player Mark Rogeric. The couple got married on Valentine's Day in 2009. They even welcomed two beautiful daughters, Valentina and Sienna. However, their marriage came to an end in 2014 when they announced their separation after five years together. They later finalized their divorce in 2016, although the couple never publicly revealed the reason behind their split. Rumors suggested that Jarek's infidelity might have been the cause. After her divorce, Lima took some time to focus on herself and her career. However, in 2021, she found love again with film producer Andre Lemires. The couple hit it off right away and started dating. On February 18, 2022, Lima announced on TikTok that she was pregnant with her third child and first with Lemurs. She shared a video of her ultrasound and wrote that her baby was coming fall 2022. Fans couldn't be happier to see Lima find love again and start her journey towards motherhood once more. In August 2022, Lima gave birth to a bouncing baby boy. She shared the news on Instagram and revealed the baby's name, Luca. Fans flooded her with good wishes and congratulations on her newest addition. This is all I have for this video. I'm really curious to read in the comments what you guys think about the whole lingerie. What do you guys think? You guys give the best comments on that. But comment below who else would you guys like to see. If you like the music you're listening to, the link is in the description. I love you guys so much. Thank you for tuning in. Until next time.